So we've been talking a lot in our sessions lately about how you can build confidence as a yoga teacher. And I think one way that you could build confidence, especially as a new yoga teacher, is to let go of the idea that there's a right practice and a wrong practice or a right style and a wrong style, right cues and wrong cues, right alignments and wrong alignments. Um, usually you're gonna begin your teaching practice with a more specific style. For instance, I teach a lot of vinyasa flow, which is a specific set of philosophies and practices. But over time, as you develop your teaching practice, you might continue to explore and develop in that style, expanding and growing and collaborating with your students, hopefully making that style more accessible, more inclusive, um, but you also might start to branch out into other styles or lineages of yoga, other movement forms, other meditation styles, and start to see a much wider range of, of practices and techniques and philosophies that we call yoga. The yoga world is really big. Um, and there's no right wrong. There's no right path and wrong path, right style or wrong style just a huge field of practice and ideas and possibilities for you to play in. So that's one of the adventures of teaching yoga.